McKenna very smoothly. And this is Letitia McKenna advancing into open space. Decides to cut central. There's no one there except the net. McKenna with a solo run. And it's saved by Langman at the near post. Best chance of the game so far. And Letitia McKenna was allowed to roam forward and very nearly made it work. She certainly was, and she does such a good job at picking up the ball between the lines there. She runs with good positive intent, uh, a little bit isolated. As you see, that touch takes her away from the goal, so she's probably got to show a little bit more patience there um, and, and recycle, but fantastic effort by McKenna. We mentioned that one-on-one -on -one duel earlier in the game. Master Antonio still following Galich everywhere. And that's fantastic for the youngster. What an experience to be playing up against Master Antonio being marked this way. Through ball from Fonson Cam Hinson. The flag stays down. This is the moment for Perth. What a great interjecting challenge from Naomi Chinema. The goalkeeper was out of the equation, but Sierra Hinson did not pull the trigger. Long ball from Grosso up to Wilkinson. Slides it inside. Policina combining once again with Wilkinson. Shuffles it out to the right. Galich turns inside. We know that left foot can be dangerous. Here's Policina. Oh, clever flick. Here's McKenna and hits the stanchion rather than the back of the net. A glorious opportunity, and that really should have been 1-0 to Melbourne City. Now Policina trying to get away from Master Antonio and does great close control, slides it to Gallage. They're lining up here, Toppy, clear off the line. Master Antonio comes up with a vital, vital stop. So often there, I mean, that's come off the shin. You, you'd be forgiven for shanking that into your own net and instead she's able to make clean contact at an awkward height to get the ball away. Torpy looks to lift the ball and it's, oh, batted into the post. Langman almost with a brain explosion there. It looked like it was a catchable ball, but in the end she went for a punch. Coming back, Wilkinson, Torpy, Policina, first touch promising, body check, penalty. And Rihanna Policina's injection into the game has been a bit of a difference maker. And now, once again, it leads Melbourne City to the penalty spot. Amina Rekic trying to score for the fourth time this A-League women's season. And on the hour mark, separate the two teams. Here's the penalty. And it's in to the corner. Clinically dispatched. And Melbourne City, perhaps their penalty woes are behind them as they take a 1-0 lead. Alex Aparkas checks his watch, but it's just about time up here. And Melbourne City have held on for three hard-fought points. Perth Glory made them earn it with a full-time score of Melbourne City 1, Perth Glory 0.